All right, I'm, uh, I'm gonna make a video about proofing. We have a uh, hydrometer here. We have three different kinds of grain alcohol, moonshine. Um, this is homemade moonshine. This is homemade moonshine. And this is Old Smoky Blue Flame. This is some stuff my cousin bought. It's 128 proof. Um, we just put it in this jar so, so we could have a little sample. Um, so we're gonna call this J. And then we're gonna call this M. So, uh, and then we'll just call this Blue Flame. We're gonna see what the alcohol uh, proof is on the hydrometer. So basically, we take the hydrometer out. We uh, fill this tube. We want to start with the, the blue flame so we can see if it's accurate. On this hydrometer, you got your proof I'm trying to zoom then you got your whatever we're gonna use the proof here I'm kind of new to the whole proofing thing so so we're pushing it down let it float up it's the old smoky blue flame give it a little shake all right it's about between 100 and 100, 120 and 130 so it, it's it's fairly accurate it's not exact but we'll take that so let's see what average moonshine homemade moonshine is so we're gonna try J J moonshine You might have to pour some of that back out. Alright, move your big old chicken nugget looking hand. <laughs> What's that at? That's that. Turn it. That's at about 80. 80 proof so that that's some good good homemade grain alcohol okay let's try the M sample this is M it's a friend of mine made this he told me he made it we done tested all these once it's kind of weird too much in there check this one out spin it around proof huh. look at that there's 185 proof that's some hardcore shit if that's homemade I mean that's close to 190 proof ever clear. That's, that's a pretty hardcore moonshine right there. It's a big difference between J and M. And even the, the blue flame over the counter. <laughs> 